Today I'm going to be sharing with you products that I've used up recently. Uh, I have quite a few to go through, so I'm just going to get started. So the first thing in my little bag here is a perfume, and this is Dreaming by Tommy Hilfiger. Uh, it took me a really long time to use this up, and a little bit of perfume that's left in here I can't get out. Um, it's a really great scent, very girly and springy. It's kind of hard to find, but um, I've had this for probably like two or three years, and I finally used it up, so that's that. Next, I have my White Citrus Perfume by Bath & Body Works. I love this scent. It's my all-time favorite from Bath & Body Works besides um, Cucumber Melon. I need to repurchase this. I just haven't. So I need some new perfumes. So if you guys know any like like scents that's like this, that's like fresh smelling, let me know in the comments because I'm looking for a new perfume like that. I have a face wash. This is my Yesti Cucumbers Soothing Sensitive Skin Daily Gel Cleanser. Use this up. You can get this at Target and Walmart. I really like this because it's very natural and good for your skin. It has vitamins A and C, and it also has aloe vera and green tea in it. It's hypoallergenic, dermatologist tested, non-irritating, and cruelty-free. So you really can't go wrong with this. This lasted me about, oh, maybe a month and a half or so before I used it up. Uh, I will repurchase it in the future eventually. I'm using a different... Uh, moisturizer right moisturizer I'm using a different cleanser in the shower right now to try out but I will definitely get some this in the future because I love it okay so for a makeup product I used up I have my Tarte light camera lashes sample I got this for Christmas and I used it up quite a while ago I fell in love with it I actually went and purchased a full size um, a few weeks ago at Sephora and I'm wearing it today and it makes your lashes look amazing and it's a really great quality mascara the only thing about it that I don't like is that it's a little bit drier than I normally like in mascaras I usually like a like a wetter mascara but this is a little bit drier in my opinion I still love it though I went and purchased it when Sephora had their like VIB chic week whatever you want to call it and by the way their discount this year wasn't as good as last year so yeah but I used that up I have a little moisturizer sample that I got in a birch box. I don't even know the name of the company, to be honest. Uh, I like the scent of this. Um, didn't really do anything crazy good for my skin. I used it when I was in between moisturizers just to use it up, so that's that. Actually, I actually have another tube of that, too. I also have another mascara sample, and this is the Fresh Supernova Mascara. Now, I love the packaging of this, but this mascara sucked. <laughs> I hated this mascara. The wand, I'll show you, is like super ginormous. <laughs> so it made it really hard to work with. And I just felt like it didn't do anything for my lashes. Um, I didn't like it. It smelled funny. It just clumped. I, didn't I just didn't like it at all. So I won't be repurchasing that. Um, I you finally used up my Sephora Instant Moisturizer. This is my new Holy Grail Moisturizer. This stuff is amazing. I heard about it through Emily Clark here on YouTube. It's the best moisturizer I think I've ever used. It's better than the Cl Clinique moisturizer that I used. It doesn't break me out. It's super moisturizing because it's more like a cream that you put on. So it really gets, it just works amazing. It's $20 at Sephora. If you've never tried it, I suggest you get a sample just to try it out. Um... It doesn't really smell that bad or anything. I use it every day. I just, I love it. I feel like it's helped my skin a lot. And I already repurchased this because it's the best stuff on the planet. My last three things are makeup wipes. So I'm going to try and talk to you guys about which ones I like the most. And yeah. So this is the Aveeno Ultra Calming Makeup Removing Wipes. These are pretty much my favorite ones. I just repurchased these today actually when I went to, the, to Rite Aid to get another pack. They do a really good job at taking my makeup off. Uh, they don't burn my eyes, and they're just really great. Uh, my next pack of makeup wipes are my Neutrogena Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelettes and Night Calming. These were okay. They weren't, like, like really great. Um, they had a nice scent to them because they were for use at nighttime. They were gentle, um, but they weren't the, the best wipes I've used. Um, I probably won't repurchase these in the future, but I gave them a try because they were on sale, so that's why I got them. And my last thing in here is a pack of the Olay Fresh Effects Swipe Out Refreshing Makeup Removal Cloths. Now, I bought these because they were on sale for $4.99 at Target. I'm like, okay, I've seen these around. I'll try them. These are the worst makeup wipes I've used on. They're terrible. They're worse than 
Like, I don't even know. They were awful. They did a terrible job of taking makeup wipes off. They dried out really quickly. And the cloths themselves were really, like, thin. So they, they just, like, tore really easily when I, like, used them on my face. And I felt like these were almost exfoliating because my skin got really flaky when I used these. And I have really dry skin to begin with. So these were just awful. If you, I would not recommend these unless you have, like, really really good skin because <laughs> they did a terrible job especially at taking eye makeup off they were just terrible so those are all the products i've recently used up i hope you guys are doing well and i'll talk to you later bye